In the recent months, I had a lot of questions like how can I write longer text with ChatGPT? I want longer stories, longer articles, and this has been a real issue like with the 4K token window. Now that we have access to the 16K token window, this changes a lot. So in this video, I want to show you how you can do this. I'm not going to go into every single boring detail of this, but I want to show you how like the concept of how this works. So let's just get started. So what you're looking at now is basically the concept of how we are going to do this. We have five different steps we are going to follow. So we're going to start just with step one. So this is fill out a story ID template. So if I head over to my prompts here, you can see it. So we're just going to fill it in a genre. So I'm going to do a children's adventure for kind of my nephew. If we go further down here, we want to set some details here. So we want to set uh, the setting details. So it's going to be an exciting adventure. The main plot, uh, my nephew likes Spider-Man and Harry Potter. Travels far away to discover unimaginable things. So we just have two names, Harry Potter. We just give them an age. The side tone is going to be friendly and engaging. A central team, adventure. And again, we have children's adventure. And that is basically the full template. So when we run the script now, we will run this through a template and we will end up with something like this. This might be a bit hard to see, but hopefully you can see like the main plot. Spider-Man stumbles onto a hidden portal and we have main characters, Harry Potter and Spider-Man. Uh, we have some dialogue, we have a team, we have a desired tone, it's friendly and engaging. So that is step number one. And that was the only thing we had to do, the rest is gonna be fully automatic. So in step two, uh, ChatGPT is gonna write outlines for seven chapters from the template. So if you take a quick look here, you can see here is the outline. So you can see outline for chapter one. So we have some notes here, chapter two, three, four, five, six, and seven, right? So you get the point. These are just notes for the, or the outline notes, okay? So when that is complete, ChatGPT moves on to step number three, and that is going to write seven chapter summaries from the outline. So to keep it on, um, yeah, like on the topic, we kind of want these summaries of each chapter. So here we have a summary of chapter one, two, three. You can see Spider-Man and Harry encounters a vice old tree. Uh, I'm not going to read all this, but you kind of get the point. So this is fully automatic, and this is just completely done by ChatGPT. And then we come to uh, a kind of an important step. Uh, I kind of have to explain this. We want to write the chapters in segments. So this is step four. What ChatGPT is doing here is looking at the chapter summaries. And for to write chapter one, it's just going to look at chapter summary number one. Okay, so from chapter summary number one, I'm going to write the first chapter. And when that is done, it's going to append it to another file called story. So for each chapter, then we're going to look at the summary, write the chapter, feed it to the story file, like with the one we just looked that right so every time uh, chapter 2 is finished it's gonna get appended to that file three four five six basically as many chapters as you want until you run out of tokens of course and that is basically the simplest steps and on step five append each chapter to the story and then the story is complete it's not that uh, complicated actually when you have filled out the ID template then your job is done so now let's head over to the terminal and run the script Okay, so before we run the script, I kind of want to fire up the timer here. So let's just play that. Okay, let's go. That was the story complete. This took about 11 and a half minutes. So quite the good pace of this. Remember, this is a lot of words. So let's take a bit a closer look at the story. So we want to see how many words this is. You can see here that the full story comes into one single file. So we have chapter one here. If we scroll down all the way here, you can get chapter seven. So let's copy all of that just to count the words. I'm just going to paste it into an empty document here. Words 4,232. So that's about 10 pages. Uh, you might be wondering, is this any good? Nah, I don't know. It's 10 pages, but this is a children's story, remember? So it is quite interesting. Let's just take a listen to a piece of the story so you kind of know what kind of quality this is. As Spider-Man and Harry stood shoulder to shoulder, facing the final riddle that would grant them passage across the bridge, their minds teemed with anticipation. The ancient stone enigma seemed to challenge their very essence, urging them to dig deep into their well of knowledge and intuition. What has a heart that doesn't beat, a bed but never sleeps, and can run but never tires? Spider-Man read aloud, his voice filled with a mixture of excitement and uncertainty. Harry's brow furrowed as he pondered the possibilities. A river. It flows with a steady rhythm, providing life to all it touches, he declared, his voice brimming with conviction. Their dialogue danced through the air, intertwining with the rustling leaves and the gentle babbling of the nearby stream. 
The moment of truth hung suspended in time as they awaited the validation of their answer. So yeah, that was not half bad, right? I think this would be perfect for like some... Unless this was like a children's adventure, I think they would enjoy this. If you wanna try this script out, check out the link to my membership below. Uh, I have published this, so you can just change up the model and just run it and create this as you want. You can modify it to do blog posts, other things you wanna write that is a bit longer. So yeah, thank you for tuning in, have a great day and I'll see you again soon.